uh, we are doing good. Uh, apparently, someone down uh, with Martin. Do you, mm -hmm. you mind giving us like an accurate recap, if possible? Okay. So what I I don't I don't know everything because I didn't get to talk super at length with Martin, but it sounded like uh, JP tried to betray him and take his. Not not I don't think everything. I think it was the the dongles. So or the USBs, you know. So so that wasn't good. And from what I understand fighting of some sort, Martin shot JP and took them back, so we have them. He left them for us. Wait, wait, wait. Um, wait, 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 wait rewind, rewind, rewind. Uh, yeah. X took the dongles, ran, Martin shot his ass? Something, yeah, I don't know how it happened, but somehow he had them and Martin shot him and took them back. And Jesus? Think, were, they, yeah. were those Martin's dongles or were they, were they his? Yeah, 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 yeah the yeah, ones yeah, that they... were in his house, because from what I know, this is assumption, not really, he didn't really fill me in on this, but we had spoken previously, and Martin had told me that X had access to his house. And, you know... Yeah, he does, yeah. Yeah, so so that was all the thing, and, and the deal was supposed to be, what Martin told me previously, was that he they got to heist together, they got to rob things together, and Martin would keep the USBs, and then if they could find a good trade, they would work on some trades together, because JP was also going to go around and, and maybe heist with some other groups, same with Marty, you know, they were trying to just kind of work with a bunch of people so that they could get dongles and USBs and whatever. That comes to today, that was the deal, and then suddenly he has them in his possession, and and Martin finds that out, and I, I guess he was trying to take them. I don't really know 100%, because he didn't explain that in detail, but he said he had to shoot him to, like, take him back. I, I, remember, I remember part of the combo now, actually. Mm -hmm. uh, so, yeah, what happened was, I mean, you know, fucking... Uh, X was making all these like, you know, kind of like little threats, you know, little things here mm -hmm. and there. And then, uh, yeah, that, that's when he went to the house uh, and I guess grabbed everything. And then that's when Martin was like, okay, like, what the fuck? I think that was the tipping point. Yeah. Yeah, that's, yeah, that, 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 that was Thanks the point. Thanks for recapping that's what, what it I was. said. Yeah. Yeah, no, I, I just had to clarify it in my mind because, yeah. you know what I mean? I forgot. And I mean, I'm Martin, Martin was obviously emotionally down in that moment so i don't know how he explained yeah. it to you he was just kind of really disjointed yeah yeah uh jesus christ so so yeah. the important information is whose dongles are those is is those dongles being in our house about to drag us into a bunch of shit with 20 different fucking crews to help these guys get oh, that shit those were martin's those were martin's i know that for sure because he had told me previously that he had those in his bench and i looked after he dropped them off um and it looks like exactly the ones that he told me he had color wise and all that i think like i'm pretty sure i can't tell you 100 percent how he got all of them but i know because he had invited me a couple times and i just couldn't make it because they were doing it way too late for me but he and and larry and them you know had had gone and worked on this and gotten more usbs on their own and jp had joined them on some of it but again like i said the deal was that they were martin's usbs so i'm pretty sure that those were all just his and that was what he was trying to get stolen or you know what jp was trying to steal from him yeah that's something i was going to bring up on the way over in the car i don't think martin would put us in a position where like if those weren't his like i, I think he knows you know what i mean like he he, he wouldn't yeah. he wouldn't put that on us you know what i mean he, he wouldn't take somebody else's dongles that belong to somebody and you know yeah give them to yeah, us he would just keep and, it you know, in his house it, at that yeah, point exactly right. If, right if it belonged to somebody else he, he he wouldn't even bring that on us he, he knows we wouldn't want that Mm -hmm. I mean, I'm, I'm indifferent about that, but uh, he could be right. Yeah, my, my only my only concern is I don't know if JP knows where those are, you know, that, that we physically have them. And you know the way the guy is. I feel like he might just stake out our house or yeah, maybe I mean, stake shit, out the yeah. USB guy. You shit know. could get real fucking hot. Yeah. Um, I mean, at the, at the end of the day... Uh, we kind of spoke of this about Martin, right? When he wanted to do this fucking side crew. I mean, it's the big, it's the big reason why I emphasize, like, you're doing this on your own. Like, we're, we're contributing no fucking resources mm -hmm. because, uh, you know, it's fucking Jean-Paul. He felt like he could, he could uh, control the guy. Uh, they had a close relationship, whatever. Uh, I mean, shit went down. I, I don't know. I don't know. I, I will insane. say he kept, he kept texting and stuff and, like, walking away from me and Tony real quick to just, like, you know, send a text, come back while, while Tony and I were discussing it. So, um... And based on some of the stuff he was saying, like, he was probably texting him. They're probably just arguing, which, um, if he's not going no contact, then 
I mean, you know, I, I, I don't know. I don't love that, but at least he was showing, like, it felt like he was really done with him from a working yeah. together kind of standpoint, but definitely still in contact in some way, it felt. I don't know. I mean, I don't care who he speaks with or who he yeah. does shit with. For me, it's just uh, making sure that, that, that this... To make sure that our something that's not our problem isn't now blowing back on us when we've mm -hmm. have no involvement in this shit, right? That's kind of my concern, or, or at least where my head's at. Yeah, I How don't do know. I mean, <sighs> I mean, I, we, we got to talk to like, mine about it, right? Because, like I said, I, I don't think Martin would put us in that position. Uh, mm -hmm. But you know, but we got to talk to mine to make sure. Yeah, I mean, of course. I think it's, yeah, I think, I think he's, he's, he's sitting that we around for a fucking week. I'll try to give him a call just in case maybe he's you know. Yeah, kind of see, it. see if we can get a hold of him, maybe. Yeah, he could be around. I'll give him a call. And you guys know he, he was talking to me a lot. I'll see if maybe I can bait him out and tell him to... I won't text him right now, but maybe later I'll be like, hey... <laughs> just kind I of ask you a question. Yeah. Maybe I could catch him, because he seems to be very willing to talk to me. We connect well on a lot of stuff, so we'll see. And this also segues into a different kind of conversation, too. We do have all the USBs we need now. Uh... And yeah. I'm not going to lie, it's very tempting to do something about it. Mm-hmm. We don't even know what it'll be. I, I feel like we should probably arrange to have more of our people around just in case it starts something as soon as we drop them off. Or, like, you know, we don't really know. Yeah, on I the note that Martin left at the computer, it said don't let him go to waste, the dongles. Mm -hmm. We do this, we might be ahead of the game here. This could be pivotal for us right now. Yeah. Yeah, that is something that kind of we, we kind of have to take into consideration, right? At the end of the day, uh, this is obviously all the dongles that we've been trying to collect. Now right. collected, uh, mm -hmm. and it's you know it's Pandora's box, and I'm and I'm a kind of guy who loves to open the box every fucking time personally, but there's a mm -hmm. lot of weight around it at the same time as well, right? We also said that yeah. we wouldn't uh, you know walk around eggshells and shit uh, when it comes to like other people and uh, what they would how they would react to uh, to other stuff. You know what I mean? Yep. I say, That's something it. I was just thinking about. Say, fuck it. They want to fuck with us? They can come fuck with us. Yeah. I mean, yeah. I'm kind of on the same boat. I, I just want... We just need to know the full story. Like, I need to know exactly what happened. Personally, uh, at the same time, though, very tempting uh, offer right in front of us. You know, it's, it's Willy yeah. Wonka's golden fucking ticket. Yeah, yeah. it's like both sides. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I mean, don't want to fuck anybody day, over who doesn't deserve to be fucked over. But at the same time, right. you know what I mean? Just fucking... It, it's here now. Yep. At the end of the day, they fell into our lap from someone that we were working with the whole time who's been good to us, you know? Like, he, he might have, Martin might have had his own little problems on his end, but so far until this, you know, he has not brought any of it really to us too heavily. Yeah. So, I mean, what are we doing wrong if we just use the USBs that he gave us, you know? Yeah. From our uh, perspective, it's just The normal. same way these motherfuckers have all played dumb, robbing our sanitation workers, we're going to play mm -hmm. dumb and use their fucking dongles. Facts. Yeah. Kind of where I'm leaning towards as well. Yep. And what have uh, we done about that every time? What, maybe collapsed a couple of them back? Not even much. You know, just kind of moved on, so. Well, here comes the, we keep uh, the next topic of discussion, right? Uh, I mean, no, Shani, you just made a very good point. We should go turn on these fucking dongles right now. 